All right, guys, VLM here. We're back with more Assassin's Creed. Audit our fuck origins. Shit, I do it every fucking time. God damn it. Um, well, we're back. <laughs> uh, we're continuing off the crocodile's jaws. Um, yeah, it's kind of annoying. I was gonna name the last episode uh, the crocodile's jaws part one, but um, it didn't fit in the title, so I kind of delete it. But whatever. Uh, we're continuing on here. We're also going to continue off the Assassin's Creed Survivor thing, which we're almost done with. We're at the final six now, and it's a really mm, fucked up group. Like, it's like, I mean, such a clusterfuck, but, um, who's left? All right, let's see. It's, um, it's Tamir, Ptolemy, Torres, uh, Christina Vespucci, Marini, and Rabia. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, what was Final Six Immunity and Ghost Island? I'm trying to think. I know what the Final Five and Final Four were. What was Final Six? I uh, want this man to be my partner. As it happens, the Iberian was must race out to. Cla oh, it's a maze. Okay, the maze. I may have an open. Um, and if vouches for you, you will need a title. Okay. To yeah, I remember these. Okay, so it's the oh, maze. Um. Who'd be good at a maze here? Again, we're, we're down to some really shit competitors, in all seriousness. Um, I have heard worse. Come inside. Okay. Fuck, I thought I made my dog happy. Because he's, he was barking at me all last fucking episode. Or growling at me, now he's fucking back again. Really, what dickhead? <laughs> um... Oh, okay. um, and who wins this maze competition again? It's like this is really a clusterfuck of a tribe. I I don't know. Mary, maybe Marine, Marini, whatever. There was a there was a puzzle at the end too, right? I believe. Okay, now he's growling at me again. What a fucking asshole. Um, a vertical puzzle. Okay. Well, I feel like this is a tough puzzle. I I feel like this is like a really tough puzzle. So. I, I feel like I'll go for the gear. I feel like Torres could win this. But again, thing about this, like the feel, thing that's weird about giving Torres all these immunity wins is that obviously he's like a 60-year-old man uh, who, like, doesn't he have a limp? No, no, he doesn't. Never mind. Uh, anyway, he's not the most physically able person, so it's like, it's like funny that he's winning all these, like he's winning challenges now. Um, what do you want? Yeah, okay, like we, we're out of the physical people really on this. In this season, like the most physical person left is what, like a mix of Tamir and Marini. Like, I mean, who aren't? I mean, Marini's probably more physical because we do see Marini like ki killing a whole bunch of people and stuff. And also, I guess similarly with um, with Tamir, Tamir murders that guy at the beginning uh, when you first meet him. Um, and then, uh, and yeah, like Rabia is like nothing. I mean. Ptolemy is like, I don't know, kind of just a whiny brat, so I mean, who knows about him. What do you want? Really? My dog keeps on fucking growling at me. I don't know what the fuck he wants. Speaking of authenticity, in the arena, you use the weapons I give you. There are no Ah. You already know Kensa. I think we give it, I think we give it to Torres. No, let's give them. I don't know. At least again, I feel like the puzzle is more important here. I feel like this is a tough puzzle. Uh, it's like the upside down bat thing, right? And like that's a really tough puzzle. And I feel like. What do you say? Ready to draw a sword, old Medjay? Let's see if you have improved. Oh, what the fuck? You need more style and flash, but you have got a pleasing, vicious trick for a sand. Okay, Kinsa. Okay. We open the door soon. Be ready. Okay, so, I mean... Oh my god, my dog keeps on fucking growling. What a fucking asshole. Um, I think we give it to Torres. No, actually, let's give it to Mirini. The thing is, like, I don't think I've ever seen Torres run, right? Outside of when he was being attacked. So I, I feel like Mirini is, like... He's at the end of the day. There's still the maze portion of it. Let's give it to Marini. Uh, I mean, I don't think it matters. I think either way, Tamir's going, right? Yeah, Tamir's going anyway. 
Yeah, I think they all vote for Tamir. Except for uh, Ptolemy and Tamir who vote for Christina. Stop. What the fuck does he want? So we're at the final five. Final five now with Ptolemy. Which all the Templars are gone. Uh, fuck. I really thought the season... I was thinking like at the beginning of the season. Oh, this is the season where Templar is going to win. Because I don't believe a Templar has won so far. It's either been an assassin. Or I think actually the majority of the winners have been people in the middle. I don't think there's been like, like people... Non-assassin or Templar people. Um, but yeah, I don't believe a Templar has won. Actually, to be honest, I don't even think that many Templars even make it to Final Tribal. I'm trying to think of like who's made it to Final Tribal that was a Templar. I know Kalisat made it. Um, there's probably more, I'm just not thinking of them. But. Any blood will do. No such thing as innocent here. Do not stake your blade, brother. They certainly will not. Every man here knows the risks. You have taken to the hey, this feels a lot more like uh, Odyssey because of how many fucking hits these guys take. Oh no. Oh no. No, what the fuck? Okay, fine. Oof. What the fuck? Why can't I pull out my bow? Wait, 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 wait. What do you mean, oh, fuck off? Oh, we don't have a bow, do we? I forgot about that. We don't have a bow in the arena. Oof. So, I mean, that looks like dog's done. So, I mean, we have the final five here. Final five immunity challenge was a, a fuck. Another physical challenge uh, with a puzzle at the end. Kind of a generic challenge at this point. Uh, I mean, who wins this? I mean, again, this is a top. Again, there's no physical people left. Uh, it's like, I guess, Mirini? I mean, the puzzle at the end was like a four piece puzzle. And to be honest, a pretty simple one if you, like, just look at it the right way. Um, oh, no. Oof. Go. Should be the final wave, right? Um, it's kind of weird having to actually try and <laughs> origins again. Uh, these have obviously be uh, of nightmare. Oh, oh my God! Really, I really died from running into spikes. That's pretty annoying. Yeah, this uh, this boss battle is gonna be brutal. Oh, fuck off! I do the entire thing again. Are they screaming for our blood or for theirs? Any blood will do. No such thing as innocent here. Do not so, okay, final five immunity was that. Um, I guess Mirini wins. I don't know. Again, like, who the fuck's left? I mean, we got Torres. He wins like a 60 year old. And then again, Mirini is also like 60 years old or so, right? But it's not even like Mirini is young either. I mean, um. Um. Yeah, there's Mirini, there's Rabia. Rabia is definitely not winning. Um. There's Ptolemy. I guess Ptolemy could win, right? I, mean, I guess Ptolemy could win. Um, let's have Ptolemy win, actually. I think it makes it more interesting. He's obviously, I think that opens up this vote because obviously Ptolemy is probably the next boot if he does, doesn't win. Um, so I think Ptolemy wins immunity here. Um, so what does that mean, though? Anyway, uh, who's the other person? Christina Vespucci. Um, actually, I can see her being decent. I mean... Uh, uh, yeah, actually, I probably had. I, I kind of forgot about her, actually, to be honest. Uh, she maybe should have won a couple of these other challenges, but yeah, either, either way. Um, so, I mean. Oof. 
No, oh my god, what the fuck? What? Oh, fuck off. Okay. I guess I'm gonna take this seriously. What the fuck? Um. God damn it. I thought we had it that time, too. Um. Are they screaming for our blood or for theirs? So, they certainly will not. Every man here knows the risks. You have taken to the oh, what the fuck? What? Oh, my God, I really died again. Okay, well, this is something. Um, yeah, what the fuck? Okay, um. But yeah, um, uh, what was the challenge again? It was the puzzle, um, you have taken to this new life okay. easily. Can you see me? Look on their faces. They adore me by it. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck was that? Uh, but yeah, so, and let's just have Ptolemy win for the sake of it. Just whatever. Ptolemy wins. Are they screaming for our um, blood? Or for who, who goes home? I mean, it's, it's, okay, so it's essentially, this is Marine's choice, and it's essentially whoever Marine is more loyal to here, and it's like, I, I think Rabia is safe, I don't think anyone's getting rid of Rabia, there's no reason to get rid of Rabia, so it's really between Christina Vespucci and, and Torres, and while I do think, uh, she's probably closer to Torres, I feel like Torres is also more of an endgame threat for her, than Christina, Christina Vespucci. It's like, who the fuck's voting for Christina on this jury? I mean, there's a couple, but it's like, I don't feel like there's that many. Uh, while with Torres... And but then who is also voting for Torres? I, I think it's a bit of a... I don't know, it's, it's kind of up in the air, really. Um, yeah. Oh, no, no, I just realized Torres is a Templar, isn't he? So I guess there's one more Templar left. Um, oof, what the fuck? Again, like part of why this is like being somewhat difficult for us is just because again we're without a bow, and like when you're when you're like when you get injured this easily, like usually you use a bow to kind of counter that, so you can do damage from far away. But it's like here we have to do it up close anyway. Ah, so this is tough. Who she bowed out? It's e it's either Torres or Marini. Uh, it, it was our Christina. I'm kind of thinking Christina at this point, actually. He's at least like with, like he's. I mean, the temp a lot of the Templars aren't super happy with Torres anyway. I mean, because he's been flipping back and forth. While with Christina, I think Christina has a lot of these, like assassin or assassin adjacent votes if she gets to the end. I I, I think she has like Stefan. She has Charles Dorian. Uh, man, that might be it, actually. I believe those were actually the only two assassins, weren't they? Uh, uh, you know. Oh, no! Oh, my God. No, no, no. Okay. Oh, my God. We almost died from the fucking spikes. There we go. First round's done. Um... Uh, So, let's see, I, I think Ptolemy and Torres vote for Christina, I think Christina votes for Torres, and then it's be who Rabia and Mirini decide to vote for, and again, at this point, I'm not entirely sure who they vote for, who, I mean, I, I think, 
looking at this again, I, I feel like they gotta vote out Torres. I think it, I, I don't want Torres to go, but I feel like they gotta get rid of Torres. Because and I, I feel like obviously Torres has a much better relationship with Ptolemy than Christina has with Ptolemy. So I think you gotta get rid of Torres. So essentially we're, we're left with three women in, in Ptolemy. Uh, with Mirini, Rabia, Christina, and Ptolemy here at the end here. And final four immunity. Uh, final four immunity is the uh, it was the stacking. No, it was the uh, yeah. I mean, it was stacking the balls in the tower, right? Uh, which I, I think this is uh, I, I think this is either Christina or, or Mirini's to lose. Uh, again, we're not gonna go with the stupid fire making rule. We're not gonna bother with that. Fuck that. We're gonna go for a straight up vote. So I think Christina wins this. I think let's just say Christina wins this. You will have to ask Felix about those quietly. The best way to reach the crocodile is to beat the Gallic brothers. As if I needed more reason to slit the throats of Shadia's killers. Okay. So um, oh, where's oh, he's right here. So. Some yeah, I, I think they all vote for Ptolemy, right? Extra they all vote for Ptolemy. Ptolemy probably votes for... Well, well, if Christina has immunity, I guess he votes for Mirini. It's only shot. Your job so there we go. We're at the final the three. Fight. So let's pick a winner. We'll pick a winner here. Next episode, we'll probably go ahead and start Season 9. We are ready. Finally. They are asking about you too at the arena in Sari. Put on a good show and we all profit. So, first I gotta figure out who. Uh, okay, wait. So, who's the final three? It's Christina, it is Marini, and it is Rabia. Okay. So, three females, all female final three. That's something as well. Um. Uh, yeah, especially because the season started as only four females. Um, How often do you fight lions? <laughs> only when Felix can get them. They are much more expensive than men volunteering for it. There seems little honor in killing animals. Oh no. Kill or be eaten by it. It's caged. We will be fine. As long as we don't free it. No, oh, oh my god, are you serious? Really? Yeah, without a bow, this is like really fucking difficult. Because usually you would like rely on your bow to hit these guys from far away, but it's like you can't do that here. Oh my god. And again, this doesn't have the shield break from from Odyssey, so it's like it's kind of tough for these guarded enemies too, because for those you'll need these heavy attacks. Which again, by the time you do a heavy attack, you're probably going to be fucking attacked anyway. Actually, we have an instant charge sword, don't we? Do oh, no, but we don't have our own weapons. <laughs> ah, yeah, we don't have our own weapons, do we? They are much more expensive than men volunteering for a Fuck off. There seems little honor in killing animals. Oh, fuck off! Are you serious? I missed twice in a fucking row? We will be fine. As long as we don't free it. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Let's go for this one. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck? We're like barely even injuring him. Oh my god. You know, I, I think we might have to turn down difficulty for this. Because uh, this is kind of bullshit. Should we? Uh, I think we changed to hard. I feel like this is the only time where our nightmare difficulty is actually difficult is during these like set piece areas. Uh, because like during the actual gameplay, it's not that difficult. Um, 
So, I mean, yeah, so the final three is Christina, Marine, and Rabia. And again, from base, like, just from general, like, looking at the cast and everything, and, like, how this game's gone, I, I feel like Marine wins. But again, it might be different. Yeah, I, I thought certain other people won before, and it turns out they didn't win, so. I just realized, us maxed out and everything, like, in this particular OCR. Like, the damage that he does to him is, like, a thousand and it's critical and stuff. Like, in Assassin's Creed, uh, in Assassin's Creed Origins, isn't, like, critical, like, isn't, like, normal damage that, like, once you're fully leveled up, isn't that, like, 10,000? Like, it's, like, it's a lot more, I mean. Like, it's above 10,000, I believe. It's kind of weird how the scaling of the... That sort of stuff is different in this game. Ah, shit. Okay. Okay. So, let's go through the votes. We got Reginald Birch. And I feel like he's a tougher vote to really distinguish. I don't know where Reginald Birch really goes, to be honest. Uh, again, obviously, if Torres was at the end, I think that's an easy vote for Torres. Uh, however, I, I think he leans Mirini, but I don't think it's a solid vote. You got Tamir, who, again, I think it again, means Mirini, but not very solid. Uh, Medunamun, uh, I think same thing. Ptolemy, same thing, probably. Um, Stefan, I think Stefan votes for Christina. I think that's something. Um, and then I also think Charles Dorian votes for Christina. And then, I don't know, like where do these other people go? Again, I feel like there's people, there's a lot of people who were a lot closer to, I feel like there were a lot of people who were close to Marini. Her talents were uh, oh, I think Vali is a, a lock vote for Mirini. I think that's a lock vote. Um, I think Marcos is a lock vote for Rabia, which is probably the only vote she's going to get. So there we go. So it's 2 on 1 right now. And yeah, I just feel like everyone else is in the middle, and I feel like that's what's kind of tough about this. Is that they're all Templars, too, by the way, uh, which... Yeah, it's like, I feel like they're all kind of in the middle here. Kenzo, okay? Holy Anubis. I have to win this. You would think so. Okay. So, where do these other votes lie? Um, again, it would be cool if we had the Spartan kick here. Um, no, wrong guy. Ah, damn it. funny like looking at the scaling of everything it's like so much lower than it is in uh or uh, in odyssey i mean where like the amount of damage you do and like the amount of health all these enemies have is much lower uh in terms of like the actual numbers and same thing with the amount of xp you get for every little thing is lower uh If you had a bow, you finish this really easily. Is that it? Or is there one more round? Alright, that's it. So... Let's see, I mean, Severe? 
I don't know. This is tough. Because Birch and Torres and I think Severe. No. Bir yeah, Birch and Torres, I think, are voting along the same lines. I think Ptolemy, Tamir, and Madunamun are voting along the same lines. And I think Severe is just kind of on his own. Um, and you know, I, I think Severe probably votes for Christina. I can see Severe getting along with Christina more than Mirini. Then can I? I don't know. I I, I do feel like Mirini wins this. I, I do I, because I do feel like the Tamir. Just know that our future. I feel like Tamir, Madunaman, and Ptolemy all vote for her, and I feel like along with that is Torres and Birch. So I feel like she wins. She wins one, two, three, four, five, six votes already. Six to two to one, and there's only one vote left. So it's like she wins, but it's like. Um, where does Sever go? Does he go Christina or does he go, uh, whatever. Uh, I'm trying to look, like, were they, were they ever, they were never on the same tribe either, her and, um, like, Sever and Christina, I'm talking about at this point. Um, I mean, they were in the same opening tribe, but were on the opposite side of the numbers. Uh, let's just have him as a Christina vote. Why not? There we go. Six to three to one. Mirini is the winner of the season of Survivor. Uh, which again, it is kind of strange uh, because this, I believe this is the third winner from. Okay, all right, let's think of the winners. Who are the winners? It's um, season one was Altair. Season two was Adewale. Uh, again, I haven't been super happy with the winners, and that's why, like, when we do the All Star one that we're eventually gonna do, it's gonna be non winners It's really gonna be a second chance sort of thing, really. Like, it's gonna be no winners just because I don't feel like there's any, like, there's only like one or two winners I would even want to have back anyway. So it's like at that point, I won't have any. Um, so there's Mirine. I oh wait, no, there's um Altair one season one, Adewale one season two, both of which I was kind of like let down by them being the winners of these things. Um, season three was Maria Adatore, who again was fine, but it's like. Not my favorite. Um, then season four was Leonidas, who was like, again, I think Mario got robbed. Uh, season five was Kira, who I think Kira, like, based on the way that we it played out and everything, I think it was uh, pretty fun to play out. But um, season six was what, Mason Lock Weems? Is that season six? Which was okay. I mean, I, I, I think. Um, yeah, it was an okay one. Again, not one of the winners that I think would have been contention for like an all-star sort of one if we were going to use winners. And then season 7 was the rim, which is fucking boring. Um, I didn't want him to win, but again, it played out to uh, end up having that be the case. So, yeah, and then now obviously Marini. So, yeah, three people from Odyssey, uh, which is a lot, I believe. I mean, both Durim and Altair won, so if you don't know, they're, um... Actually, let's, let's actually, oh, oh, no, I can't? Or can I? Okay. Uh, I want to try to do this Nightmare, actually. I just want to try it once. If we fail, then we fail, but... Oof. Yeah, this is going to be tough, isn't it? Yeah, they lower the amount of damage you do, don't they? Yeah, if we had bows, this would not be nearly as difficult. Um, oof. We're surprisingly not actually getting hit, though. Um, oof. Um, to be honest, like, best case scenario for this is actually to lower both their health at the same time. Like, it's not really super beneficial to kill one. Um, because, like, once you kill one, it, um... The other one like goes into full rampage mode and stuff. Um, we switched it to nightmare, right? It doesn't feel like we're on nightmare. Um, wait, 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 oh wait, fuck. We did switch back to nightmare though, right? Just making sure. Yeah, okay. It's not. It doesn't feel that difficult actually. Um, right here. I thought it would. But, okay, well, that, I mean that was something. Oh shit, okay, well that's not good. That's not good, that's not good. Oh shit. Oh my god. Ah, oh, damn it. Fuck. We're kind of close there. Uh, what is this?
they're wait they're remaking the last remnant why wait that's the game that i'm thinking of right the last remnant yeah why are they remaking the last remnant whatever um Sam Marini wins. Uh, so I, I believe the uh, actually gender wise, it's actually not that bad. It's saying like gender. I mean, like in terms of females on this on these survivor things, like uh, most of the seasons have had four to six females out of twenty, which isn't a lot, obviously, just because again we're really lacking in females. But it's like uh, in this aspect in general, things where they like, name the characters who are actually memorable. Um, but. Yeah, we've actually had three winners, three female winners. So I feel like that's not that bad um, out of eight. So it's like it's five to three. That's not bad considering, again, the, the breakdown initially. I mean, like, and as I said, yeah, I mean, like, I'm trying to think, like, out of the winners, um, let's see, I mean, so Altair was assassin, Adewale was assassin, so it was two assassins in a row. Maria is also an assassin, so I guess really the first three winners were all assassins. And then we got a streak of two Templars, right? Um, or not two Templars, two like non-assassin or Templar people in um, in Leonidas and Kira. And then also Mason Lockeens was not either. And then there's another assassin in the rim, and then now another. So yeah, it's been four assassins, four non-assassin or Templar people, and no Templars. Which I wish would be rectified, but I, I know the cast for next season, and it's probably not going to be. Which I think is a shame, because I do want a Templar to win, uh, but it just seems like it's not on the cards for any of these seasons. Um. Is he dead? Oh no, I didn't mean to kill him. Oh no, this is gonna be bad. I mean, we could still do it though. Actually, to be honest, this isn't this isn't su oh fuck. Okay, this isn't like super super difficult though. Uh, like this definitely feels doable. Oh, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad. That was very bad, that was not good. Oof. Probably I would get a little bit more health than this. Oof. Am I not gonna get more health? Oh no! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! We fucking had it! We were so close! No! We were so close! Come on! Oh my god, there's so many notifications from fucking cheap ass gamer. It's actually kind of annoying. Uh, I think we might switch it back to hard. To be honest, we're wasting way too much time here. Not that we're really in a rush or anything, but it's like I don't want to be stuck here forever and I kind of want to. Ooh, I did not mean to do that. Uh, oh, did I hit it? Oh no, I must have hit it. Shit. I didn't mean to do that. Oh well. Yeah, damn it. Um, so yeah, next, uh, next episode we'll start Season 9, the final season. And it's a bit of a clusterfuck of a cast because you know, we were running out, we're definitely were running out of people, but there were still a couple people that I did want to use. And um, there were actually a few. It's this one, right? Why isn't this listed as a new game plus, by the way? I, I don't get it. Why is this not listed as a new game plus? Okay. Whatever. Um, yeah, it's kind of a clusterfuck cast because it's like half the cast are like the remaining people that I kind of wanted to use from um, all these other games. And the other half are like kind of DLC characters. Either DLC characters or a couple characters that were in like side games like Xiao Jun and Anastasia. And Nikolai I also have on the list. Um, yeah, let's switch this back to, let's switch this back to hard.
Because, uh, just, I mean, we should just finish this up. Um, yeah, like, the cast for next season is Talal, who is the... Well, I mean, should I actually do this now? Um, like, it's, it's a lot of, like, kind of more random people. But, um... I should really have watched this. Let's just get this. Oh, what the fuck? Really? Okay. Actually, really, we should focus on this guy first, really. I, I feel like this is the guy to uh, take out. Oh my god, what the fuck. Yeah, I wish we had a bow. Like, this would be so much easier with a bow. Because, like, we're missing out on a lot of opportunities to kill, hit, hit these guys because we don't have a bow. Oof. Oh my god. Oh, fuck off. Oof. Oh my god. Yeah, like right here, we'd be able to finish them off with a bow. Oh my god, what the fuck? Oh, what the fuck? Are you serious? There we go, we did it. Um... I still find it weird. It's kind of just like this random fucking person we've never seen until just now. This is the real reason you came to me, isn't it? To uncover this patron, this crocodile. Bayek, why didn't you confide in me? Huh? I would have helped you. You're a mercenary, just now, like them. I couldn't take the chance. What fate awaits oh, the fallen? No. Will it be life? Bayek. Or death? You know me better than... Death. Bayek, you have to know! Okay. There we go. We'll end the episode in a second here. So, I mean, um... Yeah. Uh, next episode, we'll go ahead and start... The Assassin's Creed... We'll start Season 9. Sorry, I'm moving around here. Of, uh, this Assassin's Creed Survivor thing. Which uh, should be interesting. I mean, it's the final one. Uh, a lot of ridiculous people on this cast. Uh, especially because, again, we were adding DLC characters. So, uh, some really fucking... Like, uh, it, it, there's a lot of dumb <laughs> people. And one in particular. One really fucking dumb thing. that Dumb uh, person I put to the cast. Which is funny. Uh, spoiler alert. Um, he used to be called Jack the Lad. <laughs> um... Uh, that'll be funny. But alright, um come on, let's go.
Anytime now. Well, it's taking forever, isn't it? Uh, okay. There's the crocodile. We're still doing the crocodile's jaws. But we will go ahead and continue with this next episode. So for now, thank you for watching.